Hi, I'm Bill Myers, and this is another one of my video tips of the week. In this week's video tip, I'm going to show you one of the easiest to use free teleprompters that's available today. This one is called Easy Prompter, and what you see on the screen is what it looks like. The way it works is you enter your text, you choose the starting font size, the starting speed, you choose whether you want to capitalize your text or not, or whether you want to flip the text. You'd flip the text if you were using a mirror effect. You're probably not going to be doing that. And then to start your prompter, you just press Start. And you'll see here that it says hit play to start. And there's a play button right down here that we can hit to start. And on the bottom you see there's controls called jog. And then there's a pause button. There's the minus button, the speed button, the plus button, the font size button, another font size up button, detach and edit. We'll just play these. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to hit the play button. And you can see how it scrolls the words on the screen. If I want to pause, I just hit the pause button and it stops right there. If I hit play again, it keeps moving. If I want to jog it, which means it makes it jump, I can do that to make it jump up or jump back. If I want to slow it down, I can hit the minus sign to slow the speed down. Or if I want to speed it up, I can do that. If I hit pause here, if I want to increase the font size, make the words larger, I can do that. I can do this to make it smaller. The detach means this player bar, I can have it detach from the screen. So the player bar can be moved around by itself. So you can even move it off your teleprompter so it's not in the way or you can move it back and if you do want to retach it all you have to do is click the X right there and it'll put it back where it is. So you can see it's pretty easy to use. It's not fancy. There aren't a lot of things you can do other than what I've shown you but it's very easy to use. Now let me show you why I like this. If you go to their website and it's called easyprompter.com you can run this online if you like. Of course that means you have to be connected to the web while it's running. However, if you want to, you can download the portable version which is free. And that's what I've just shown you is the portable version. And to get that, you just click this link. It takes you to a page and tells you how to download. Basically, you come down here and you right click and do a save as. So I do right click and save link as. It asks me where I want to save it. I save the link. Now what it's going to do is going to save an HTML file. And that HTML file is actually the program itself. And this HTML file will run even when you're not connected to the web. You can put it on a thumb drive if you want to to move it from device to device. So to start it once you have it on your computer, you just start the HTML file that you've just downloaded and it'll look like that. Then you paste in the text that you want to edit or you can type in the text if you haven't already edited it somewhere else. And then you can start the prompter. And to start like this, it starts right up. And like I said, once it starts, you can hit the play bar to get it started and you can hit the pause. And then if you want to go in and edit your words, you can click edit. So this is a very simple teleprompter that's easy to use and it's free. It works on Macs as well as Windows. It's easy to download and easy to move from computer to computer. You can find this at easyprompter.com. I'm Bill Myers. This has been another one of my video tips of the week. You can find more like this at www.bmyers.com.